okay, it's time to go work out, a okay, okay, it's time to go work out, a going to the gym. My daughter's like, why do I have my pants pulled all the way up here? Picture me folded, what? never that boy Can't lead a kill without the drugs and the cap no. boy If I wouldn't see neck, baby Yeah, that's on my back, boy Get ear to the max, boy Finny, that's a fact, boy I'm from a place where it's dark outside The late nights, you can't walk outside Bullets got the names on them Hit you when your homeboys ride As your mom shed a tears and she wondering why Uptown double H, man, it's be the five MP in the cut, yeah, we get it live Ay. Moses can't go to any hood, but it's connect shump could, baby shump hella good, baby. Okay, a Fab MPY used to be uh -huh. Page Street, we was right next to JB. Yeah. Hot box, not the Pontiac, talk couldn't see. And it's like that we live, man, it's full of sin. So we cope with the pain, bottle with a chin. Hey, New York brim, fresh corn, red Tim. Dice games on the corner, can't play if your pocket slim. Hey, can't play, boy, never him. And don't play the game if you ain't trying to win. I'm just trying to change my L's to 100 wins. Hey, big dubs, you feel me? Yeah. I'm just trying to turn my L's to 100. Just came from the gym, and I had to come in here and fries and Kroger's. Let me tell y'all, when I walked in, I had got two really nice plants from here. Girl, they shot up and grew so nice. This is like about a month and a half ago, and I'm gonna have to show you guys the video. But um, I just came in here just now, and they have some new plants. Girl, look at this beauty. Ain't she beautiful? This is a beautiful tree. Look at this. It's like a tree damn near. Ain't she a beauty? $14.99. And the Kroger grocery store. This at, we in the liquor aisle too. Because that's where the water is at. But um at the back at the, at the back. I'm not getting no liquor. I wish. But um look at her. She is a beauty. Look at this plant. Ain't she pretty? She is beautiful. Girl, she is beautiful. Nice and big and full. Mm. Yes, I have been learning how to take care of the plants now. I've seen her. Now, I know my kids are going to be like, why did you bring another plant home? But at least it wasn't another dog or something or or something we didn't need. I like the clearance aisle wherever I'm at, okay? You never know what you'll find up in here. They got baby... Wait, they got Reese's peanut... Did I not see on the top they have Reese's peanut butter cups? Got my new baby. She is a beauty, right? This is a pretty ass plant. I know I look a hot mess, but you will see what I look like afterwards. I love you all. Rebel, love you all. Good morning, guys. What's up? So I'm on my way to the vein doctor. You know, I really, um, I really did feel like going today. I'm just like so over it. Um, I don't really have too many more treatments to go, but I just really didn't feel like going today. I'm not even getting injected with anything. I'm just going for the ultrasound so they can just check where they did the last injection make sure there's no blood clotting that's the only reason why i'm going and that's like a 10 minute if that appointment i'm only going because um that other dollar tree is over here in sun city and it's really big it's a huge dollar tree and the neighborhood that it's in is a senior citizens neighborhood like you have to be 55 and over to live in sun city so they always be having stuff at this one so i'm gonna go to that afterwards but um I just really didn't feel like going today. I just wanted to stay home and get some work done. Sometimes I just be wanting to like really like sit still and not do anything. And I wish this damn truck in front of me would hurry up and get over because I drove like I'm just driving like really slow behind him here on the freeway. Let me tell y'all, the people here in Arizona can't drive for shit. So if you from Arizona, like if you a native and you watch this video, you can't drive for shit. Y'all can't drive for shit. Like he got his signal blinkers on to get over to the left for like, shit, like three exits already. Like, are you gonna get the fuck over or not? Like, I hate when people do that. Turn them blinkers the fuck off because I'm sitting back here waiting for him to get over. Not only that, I'm not even driving that fast. I don't wanna be too close to him because it's like a dump truck type thing. And it ain't a dump truck, but you know, it looked like it, it got rocks up in there and dirt and I don't need that shit hitting my windshield. These people out here can't drive for shit. They definitely can't drive for shit. Pissing me off with their driving skills. Be driving like they ain't got no sense out here. Like you don't see that blinking on your dashboard in front of your face blinking away. Glad I'm getting off this exit now. Anyway, 
I'm just doing that today. Yesterday I was supposed to go back to the weight doctor. It was Monday, but I didn't go. I didn't go. For one, I had to go to the CPR. I went to, I went and did the CPR and first aid training. And that was four hours. Um and I had to take it because, you know, I have custody of my grandson, my daughter's son. It was from nine to one. Yesterday was just like too long for me. But on top of that, I joined the gym. Okay, I joined the gym. I went to the gym on Sunday with my daughter, Jane. She had been asked me to come along and tag along with her so many times. Okay, this has been going on for a minute. I'm like, nah, I'm not going there because of COVID. Girl, I did a little over four miles on the treadmill. A bitch is happy. I was so determined to stay on that damn treadmill, okay? And what's so crazy, like, people love to listen to music. Like, I can't just do music at the gym. It doesn't distract me, like, cause I still will look at the damn machine, like, damn bitch, we only been on here five minutes. Oh my God, I got this much longer to go. This be me on the machines. Now, you know, they got better streaming devices, better quality, Wi-Fi. So, you know, if I watch The Walking Dead, okay? Okay, and I was distracted and it was such a great experience. I really enjoyed myself. But anyway, guys, I'm going to get in here and I am going to go to my next appointment. Good morning. Good morning. I found some cute um, compression socks. You did? Yep. My subscribers told me about it um, on what, last Wednesday because I was like, I'm tired of wearing these ugly socks and I had showed them in a the video. And it was like, you know, like they have really cute ones on Amazon. I was like, what? So I looked it up. Girl, they have some cute ones. I got them delivered the same day. Yeah, I paid extra three dollars. But yeah, they got some really cute ones. Mm -hmm. Yeah, me too. So now I can go outside and style. Yeah, because I was mad. I never knew they would make something so cute like that. Yeah, they real cute. I see. I was. Okay, so I'm done with getting my leg like ultrasound and they brought me to some other room. I wonder what they're gonna tell me. Normally I just go home after that, but I don't know. We'll see. Static, painful, that sort of thing. I would put you more on a blood thinner. Um, no, I just had her. Yeah, I don't feel anything. Let's just do aspirin then. Do a baby aspirin. That's a mild blood thinner. It's not like a big blood thinner like Zeralto or Eliquis or Coumadin, anything like that. And then I'm going to look at it next week and see what it looks like. Trin has mild blood thinning properties. Okay. And all I want to do is thin the blood just a little bit so it flows through that area a little bit better so it doesn't get worse. Mm -hmm. Now remember when it's healing, it will look a little worse before it looks better because those veins are kind of purple. Mm -hmm. They'll look darker. Um, and then it'll start fading away. So it is a process. And then bring your stockings because we'll put them on after. Okay, I didn't wear them just now because I knew she was going to put that gel. Just be on aspirin for seven days. Okay. And then I want to look at that right calf again. On Tuesday? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Next Tuesday, we'll we'll do the ultrasound first. Mm -hmm. And then we'll do your sclero. Okay. It's always something. I swear it's always freaking something. The medication that they have to put in my veins is sometimes it'll settle in your muscles so it settled in my muscle and my calf and she wants to have me take aspirin once a day for a week to thin my blood out so it could um so they can move it around i don't know something like that oh my car smells like weed wait where's my chapstick i do got chopsticks. but i got everything not everything but i got a taser i got one of those little hunting knife things you know it got scissors on it. It got a screw for a wine on it. It got um a little knife on it. I got hand wipes, face wipes, extra brand new mask up in here, sunglasses, water, gum, chapstick, sure as you. Taser. In case you need to tase a motherfucker. Yes, girl. In case you need to tase somebody. We got that on, on deck. I'm gonna have to go charge this. Yep, because ain't nobody getting fucking tased right now. How the fuck did this die when, you know what, I'm mad. Because it's been sitting in my car for like two months. My girl Chrissy from Cali has sent this to me years ago, okay? 
and I have yet to have the opportunity of tasing somebody with it. All right, you know how you have something for so long. Just let me tase you one time. That's it. Like just once. I'm just tase you once. It's not gonna really hurt like that. I'm not gonna tase you too hard. You know, like some shit like that. Like I have yet to have the opportunity of tasing somebody. Anyway, you guys, let me get out of here. I'm gonna go to the Dollar Tree. Then I'm gonna go home, and I am going to um edit real talk definitely want to get me something to eat because i'm starving tonight i'll go to the gym listen to me i sound like i'm a pro at it now right hopefully i'll go to the gym tonight and work out. after my appointment i went to the dollar tree and y'all know i like jack in the box well y'all might not all know that but i was talking about jack in the box on like a recent video i brought video girl i guess things are better in different neighborhoods because i'm still in the senior citizens um part of town which is Sun City, and I went to Jack in the Box because they was right down the street from the Dollar Tree on my way back home. Girl, I told y'all the loaded breakfast sandwich was sourdough bread, two nice fried eggs, ham, bacon, and sausage is bomb. But the eggs over here are so much fluffier than where I live at. Like, I don't live in the hood, but I guess because they're older people here, they got to have the best of the best of the best. Girl, let me tell y'all, I've seen, like, I seen it. Like I, I would drive over here for this sandwich because it's the bread is fluffier, the 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 eggs are fluffier. Like this is just like a better sandwich. Like altogether a better sandwich. And I wish I lived closer because I would hurry my ass up and eat it at home. But I'm gonna eat this while I'm driving. But I just thought I would share that with you guys. You know, you go into different chain food restaurants and. They are much different in different areas. Sometimes they don't have like the same thing. Girl. You know how you eat so fast that you get the hiccups? Well, that was me with the sandwich. This is a good breakfast sandwich. Jack in the box, girl. Jack in the box. Here I am. We about to go to the gym, y'all. I was about to not go. Got started feeling lethargic. I just started feeling really, really lazy. I was really not about to go. I was like, you know what, April? You really need to take a break and just relax. That's what I tried to convince myself. I really did. I really tried to convince myself. Like the first, the first thing was my leg was hurting. So I was all settled in with not going. Then I sat there and was like, oh, I want to go get one of those plants from the grocery store. And I want to go to Sam's Club. Sam's Club is down the street from the gym. Might as well just take your ass to the gym. Even though I really tried to not go to the gym, I'm here. I like justified it. And I'm still in the car going to the gym. It's only $10 a month, so like, you know, that's not bad. And even if I only go 10 days out of the month to make up for that $10, it's still worth it. But I definitely will go more than 10 times a month. That would like just defeat the whole damn purpose. That would be totally stupid if I was to only go like once, twice, 10 times a month. I mean, but it's better than nothing, right? Then I'm going to go back to fries and get another one of those plants. That plant was so pretty, oh my God. What a beautiful plant. That plant is a beauty, honey. And she fit in real nice where well, I got her. I'm gonna have to show y'all where I put her. Hope you guys are ready for a wig sale. We're about to do a new wig sale coming up because the bin has overspilled, honey. It's, the bin has overspilled. Slow rolling, you know, slow motion for me. Move it slow motion for me. But I'm about to go in here, you guys. I'm here parked and everything, ready to go. So I love y'all. Make sure y'all already come and subscribe. I will come back and let y'all know how this worked out. Hey guys, so I'm tired now. I was in there for over an hour. I did like 40, was it 40, either 30 or 40 minutes on the treadmill. I got in two miles. Then I did some leg and thigh exercises on three different machines. And now I'm gonna go to Sam's Club and get some salmon and then go to fries and get one of those plants. But yeah, I'm tired now. Got my neck fan on. It's time to go. My plant from the grocery store. Look at her. Isn't she a beauty? I actually went and used some, some contact paper on the pots, the little black pots, because you can get two. You get a big, huge one, and then you get the one, of course, that is planted in. But I like to get these um, because they come with them, and sometimes they don't, but you can ask for them, and they'll give them to you. But um, I'll take those, and I'll just put contact paper around them and make them look like something special. So I did go get the other one. She's not as tall as she, but they are beauties, okay? Aren't they beautiful? 
these are some beautiful ass plants and i think i put them in like the right area you guys they're like right here in the dining room slash living room i'm hoping what do you think panny i'm hoping that they're in the right area because i have plants around here so I decided to put it there. Then on the steps, I have those two. Same concept with the contact paper, but the shorter one used to be right here, but I put her there so she can get a little bit more light. Hello, hello, hello.